गुड इवनिंग डॉक्टर्स माई सेल्फ डॉक्टर हेमंत शर्मा एंड टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन यू अबाउट द विटामिन डी दिस इज टॉपिक in any examination you are going to get one question from this if you know this topic at least one question in your pocket okay then fat soluble this is known as the fat soluble vitamin d vitamin d we can get from diet by our food like eggs cheese fish and milk mainly non veg non vegetarian it's in the form of ergo calciferol we can say it's d2 d2 और इट कन्वर्ट्स इनटू ट्वेंटी फाइव एर्गो कैल्सिफेरोल बट इट मस्ट बी फाउंड इन स्किन इन द फॉर्म ऑफ कॉली कैल्सिफेरोल इन द फॉर्म ऑफ डी थ्री इन द प्रेजेंस ऑफ सनलाइट इट कन्वर्ट्स सो आई एम गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन द मेकेनिज्म व्हाट इज द मेकेनिज्म ऑफ सिंथेसिस ऑफ विटामिन डी इन आर बॉडी एंड वाट आर द इफेक्ट्स so sunlight when sunlight placed on our skin this is a skin then it converts into collagen calciferol this collagen calciferol enters into the liver in liver in the presence of 25 hydroxylase enzyme it converts into 25 hydroxy collagen calciferol in liver then uh, in kidney in the presence of one alpha hydroxylase in kidney it converts into 125 dihydroxy collagen calciferol why di because 25 and 1 from this enzyme then 125 dihydroxy collagen calciferol so many times so many times in so many examination they like to ask which is the active form of vitamin d so this one is the active form of vitamin d we can say 125 dihydroxy collagen calciferol or we need to say calcitriol this calcitriol is active form of vitamin d and this is helpful in what this is helpful in increase the absorption of calcium in our body magnesium phosphate and zinc if there is a vitamin d deficiency that means these levels are goes down so bones going to be weak our skin going to be dry so vitamin d is very much necessary when i am doing a check up about a vitamin d everybody is deficient nearly 95% are deficient who's coming in my opd in my outpatient department so and they are suffering from pain in the age of 50 45 year due to deficiency of vitamin d so now i am going to explain you my dear friends this deficiency vitamin d in child it causes the rickets i am going to teach this topic rickets individually not here in case of adults it causes the osteomalacia osteomalacia means weakness of bone bone weakness malacia and when there is a toxicity of vitamin d it causes hyperparathyroidism and increase the level of calcium due to vitamin severe toxication but it occurs less and i am going to explain you i am treating this vitamin d deficiency by some vitamin d sachet or by capsule with the together with milk vitamin d sachet or any capsule it's 60k 60000 k in adults adults dose 60 k not 60000 it's uh, 60 k yeah mean 60000 yeah and uh, first uh, we are going to treat weekly doses uh, weekly it's 8 weeks and then monthly lifetime lifetime we need to give this uh, once a month firstly we have to start with uh, weekly doses then we can go for once a month of vitamin d this is very much helpful so my dear friends i already explained you about the vitamin d this is a very very important topic and i hope this is enough information about the mechanism of vitamin d and what are the deficiency it causes so it is necessary for newborn also vitamin d in the form of drops they came but uh, for adults i already explained so if you still not subscribe my channel please subscribe it and if you like my video please put like on it if you have any queries any questions or any comments you can ask me and thank you for watching my lecture online that's all